Hello and welcome to Judging 101. This is the second video and we will tell you all about how judging works and what to expect on judging day. Prior to the beginning of the Canada-wide science fair, each judge will have to read your five-page report about your project that you submitted during your registration. At the Canada-wide science fair, they will visit your project before judging day without you being present. They will carefully look at your backboard and may review your supplemental documentation, including your logbook. Make sure to leave your written materials at your project on Monday. However, please do not leave expensive laptops or equipment. On judging day, they will meet you. They will look at your backboard again and listen to you talk about your project and ask you questions about it. At the Canada-wide science fair, judging is consensus-based. That means all the judges you meet will talk to each other throughout the day, and as a group, they will make a decision about your project. The judges are all placed in teams and assign a specific group of projects to judge. There are different teams for each award type, excellence, challenge, interdisciplinary, and special awards. After the judges interview you, they meet as a team to discuss each project in detail. Sometimes, they will go back and look at your project again. You may or may not be there for the second viewing. After the discussion, the judges will assign a consensus score to your project. This is how judging day will work. When you arrive in the exhibit hall, you will get a schedule that tells you what time to expect your judges for excellence and interdisciplinary awards. In the morning, the excellence awards are judged. Each interview will last 20 minutes. Plan on giving a 7-minute presentation, leaving 13 minutes for a discussion with your judge. Some judges will listen to all of the presentation, while others will interject with questions. You should be prepared for this. After lunch, the interdisciplinary awards, special awards, and challenge awards are judged. The interdisciplinary awards interviews are scheduled. You will see two judges for each award you self-nominate for. The interdisciplinary awards are 10 minutes long. Plan on giving a 4-minute presentation, leaving 6 minutes for discussion. Again, some judges will listen to all the presentation, while others will interject with questions. You should be ready for all possible scenarios. When the judges are evaluating your project, they are looking at three main areas. Scientific thought. This evaluates the science behind your project. Judges ask, how strong is the science in the project? Is the experiment or study designed to answer the question that the finalists ask? Does the innovation solve the problem the finalists identified? How well does the work support the conclusions? Originality and creativity. This is how original or creative judges find your project. They will ask, how creative or original was the finalist in creating, doing, analyzing the project? Communication. This is how well you have communicated your project. Judges will ask, how well is the project communicated? Judges will look at your visual display, project five-page report, logbook, and evaluate your oral communication. When assessing your project, judges are relying on three main things, and they are all about communication. Each judge will have read your five-page report about your project that you submit during your registration. They will also look at your backboard, listen to you talk about your project, and ask you questions about it. Communication is key at the Canada-wide Science Fair. Make sure that you have written a good five-page report, have a comprehensive display, and are able to talk about your project. Remember, the five-page report is the first impression the judges get of your project. Your judges are scientists involved with research, people who work at universities, labs, or other scientific institutions, teaching, people who work at colleges or universities, industry, people who work at companies or for themselves. This includes engineers, agriculturists, doctors, etc. 
during the day, you will see judges from different scientific disciplines. This means that you need to make sure to explain background concepts thoroughly. Don't assume your judge is an expert in your subject area. Different judges will know more or less about your subject depending on their background. Be prepared to explain concepts that may be obvious to you. They may not be obvious to your judges depending on their background. Even if they have prior knowledge of a concept, they may want to hear you articulate it. The celebration judging is for everyone and is how the judges give feedback at the Canada White Science Fair. You will see two judges during the afternoon who will come to talk to you about your project, what you did well and what you could improve. They will talk to you for 10 minutes. The judges will have a form for you to sign to show that you've received your feedback. This is a great opportunity to have a conversation with the judge. You can ask them questions and learn how to make your project better. Remember to take good notes about your feedback so you can remember it after the fair. Now you know what is going to happen on Judging Day. Good luck preparing your project and we'll see you at the Canada-wide Science Fair.